Hey there, I'm Craig Hewitt, the founder of Castos, and in this video we're going to be talking about how to get started setting up your podcast on the Castos hosting platform. So here to start with, from castos.com, we'll start by creating our 14-day free trial account. All we ask for here is your name, uh, email address, and a password. In the first screen after you create your account, we will ask you if you're going to be publishing your podcast content right from the Castos dashboard or if you'll be using your WordPress site and our Seriously Civil podcasting integration. If you're not using WordPress, no problem. All of the features that you need to publish your podcast are right in the Castos dashboard, so we'll pick that. Next, we ask if you have a podcast you want to import from another provider like Anchor, Libsyn, SoundCloud, Buzzsprout, Podbean. All we need is your RSS feed from your podcast here, and then click import. But today, because we don't have a podcast we want to import, we'll just say no thanks. Don't worry, you can do that later if you'd like as well. Okay, let's give our podcast a title, My Awesome Podcast, and let's add our first episode. So an episode needs things like a, a title, a description, and a media file at least, so let's give it that now. So the original Star Wars, of course. I haven't seen the uh, the new Skywalker Awakens yet, but uh, I am looking forward to it. So for all you Star Wars fans out there. And then we'll upload our media file here. And this takes just a few seconds to a few minutes, depending on the size of the file and the uh, internet speed that you're working with. But So we have a title, a description, and this can be HTML, so you can use... Things like links here, if you'd like. Um, and images, everything any everything and anything goes here. Um, you can insert keywords. So let's have podcasting. And maybe our podcast is about travel. If you uh, organize your podcast in series, you can put a series number here, like one. Uh, and if you want to give your podcast episode an episode number let's give it episode number one as well because this is our first episode episode type uh, so itunes or apple podcast now recognizes several different episode types by default we'll call all of them a full normal episode unless you select something different but we can go ahead and select that now and if you had an episode specific image you could upload that here but we'll go with the main feed image that we'll create here in just a minute and since we're ready to publish our episode we'll go ahead and say publish episode now So that's it. Our first podcast episode has been published and is live. And now let's take a look at the settings for our podcast as a whole and set up a few of these details. And so just to take a step back, the feed in your podcast is the thing that controls really all of the distribution of your podcast. And the feed is really two big components. One is on a on a meta level, so things like the title and the description and the cover image of your show. And this is what directories like Apple Podcasts see to tell information about your podcast as a whole. And then every time we publish a new episode, that information shows up in the channel area of your feed. But for now, let's just give a description for our podcast. This is the description of my show, keywords and relevant info go here. Uh, so this is, uh, I, I mentioned keywords because this is uh, a good way to make sure that your podcast is properly optimized for SEO in, in directories like Apple Podcasts and Spotify, using relevant and appropriate keywords in the description and in the title area are a good way to ensure that people searching for things like your podcast uh, will be able to find them. Next, we'll upload a cover image. and pick categories for our podcast. Uh, the, the categories are important for uh, setting up the discoverability of your podcast, so you'll want to make sure that you pick several different categories that are all a little bit different than, than each other, but are all relevant to what your show is about. So I'm picking these a little bit at random here, but the idea is that you want to to pick things that are, are kind of similar but a little different. It would be redundant to pick, say, three categories all in the arts parent category. Uh, so once you've done that, we can fill in things like name. Um, and if you want to uh, change the email address that 
Apple and other directories have on, on file for you, uh, you can. We go ahead and auto-populate this with the email address that you created when you opened your Castos account. If you have a website you want to set, you can do that here as well. Set if your show is explicit or not. Uh, and then down in the web page settings area, we will ask you if you want to set a different uh, slug for your podcast. I like this because this is descriptive of what my awesome podcast is about. So I will leave that. And I'll go ahead and hit save. Okay, great. Now we can see that uh, our cover image is populating here. And if we go back to our main episodes area, we see that everything is set to go. Now you're set to publish your podcast to places like Apple Podcasts and Spotify. And we'll go ahead and show you where that RSS feed is that you'll need to submit to these directories. And that is right here. So my other awesome podcast.castos.com slash feed, this big old long thing here is your RSS feed. And if you just right click or copy this and uh, hit control C on your keyboard or right click and say copy, then this is the thing that you will submit to podcasting directories like Apple Podcast, Stitcher, Google Podcast, and Spotify. So that's it with setting your podcast up on the Castos platform. I hope you enjoyed uh, learning more about this. If you have any questions, please send us a message. You can use the little chat button down here and our team will get back with you right away. Thanks so much and have a great day.